What's going on everyone? So today we're taking a look at the first ever cordless rivet tool designed for the professional trades. This is the all new Milwaukee M12 rivet tool. All right, everyone, you guys have been asking for more Milwaukee tools, and here we go, the brand new M12 rivet gun from Milwaukee. Now this was sent over from the Home Depot Prospective Program for everyone to take a look at. So right off the bat, I can tell you, just like every other Milwaukee tool, this thing is built solid. We've got a couple different batteries here. We've got the 1.5 AH, but today we're gonna use the 3.0 XC. But just to show you, it doesn't matter which one you have, they all fit perfectly fine. Now, being honest with you, when I first got this, I was a bit intimidated, but this thing is extremely easy to use. I will show you all of that here in the upcoming clips, but let's talk about build. The build is solid, just like every other Milwaukee tool. What I really like about this is it's contour to the hands, ergonomically correct. Now, you will get four different rivet heads with this gun. And what is really crazy about this is you can actually pop over 250 rivets with one charge. Now, speaking of charge, if you want to know how much battery life you still have on this tool, all you have to do is press the button and it lights up the LED lights on the side. Now, another very cool feature about this is you don't have to worry about all the rivets laying on the floor. These actually collect in the back system right here. You can take it off, empty it out, and you're ready to go again. Now, the different size rivets you can use is 3 30 seconds, 1 8 5 30 seconds and 3 sixteenths of an inch. Now once you find the size that you want, you have a built-in wrench right here to remove the existing tip. This process is really easy to do. Very quick, very efficient. Now all you need to do is find the correct size and screw it in. All right guys, enough talking, let's do some work here. We're gonna drill out 14 holes in 1 8 of an inch steel. All right, now when I used to work in the body shop, I had to put rivets in by hand. Now anybody that does that for a living knows that it is not an easy task, especially when you are trying to patch a hole and you have 30 rivets on one piece of metal. So anybody that does this for a living knows the repetitive action doesn't always feel the best on your hands. So I'm hoping that this really does what I'm hoping it's going to do. The rivets we're using here from Arrow, they are 3 16th of an inch. All right, all, here we go. Fingers crossed. Now just as I was hoping, it took that stem completely off. It is nice and clean. Now let's take a look underneath when I do this. All right, now let's speed this up a little bit. Now the one thing I have noticed is that when you're working in the down position, the rivet stems do want to come back out. Elastic gravity. Now what is truly amazing about this is how well this actually works. Everything is completely clean, but what I want to do is I want to actually set this up and see if those rivet stems actually go into the gun like they should. Now this actually collects much better when you're actually working up against a piece of material instead of pointing the gun downwards. Now if you're working with the gun pointed up, it should work fantastic. All you got to do is push those in a little bit and you're good to go. And check this out. This worked exactly like I was hoping it would. Every single rivet is tight, solid, and clean. What I'm most impressed about is that it doesn't leave any stems. There is absolutely no twisting, pulling, or jerking when you're trying to get those out. All you do is pull the trigger and then everything is done for you. So let's take this little collector off the back here and see what we got. And now you don't have these all over the shop floor. 
All you gotta do is put it back on, you're ready for some more work. Did I mention this comes with an LED light just in case you're working in a dark area? Now the only two issues I found with this tool was one, the rivet stems actually come out if you are facing this gun in a downward position. And my biggest complaint is that they didn't have this 20 years ago when I was doing body work. If you're doing steel fabrication, if you're working with metals and you need pump rivets, I'm telling you, check this out. This will save your hands. Really effortless to use. I could not be happier with this rivet gun. Now, I will put this link for the tool in the description below. I'm telling you all, check this thing out. It will change the way you do things. I also want to give a shout out to Milwaukee. Our subscribers have been asking for Milwaukee tools for a long time, and here you go. And as always, if this video has helped you, please thumbs up, subscribe, check us out at www.tourreviewzone.com, and we will be back with more reviews soon.